Hello everybody, this is Procrastinating Gaming and welcome back to Halo 3 as we play Crow's Nest. This is actually, I think, the third attempt at recording this mission. <sighs> Basically, we've been having some power issues recently where I live and my laptop, which I used to record, basically lost power and completely wiped all the video files I'd done. Ooh, looks like um, we're on a bit of a back foot here. Check it out. No way. A Spartan? For real? You better not be. Oh man, he's here. We're gonna be. Where did you find him? Napping. Out back. <laughs> I'll bet. It's good to see you, Chief. Likewise. Nice to see you too, Let's Miranda. To Actually, yeah, Chief would only think Johnson and Miranda were captured, wouldn't he? You can see him get rescued. Whoa, that's a great entry on into the base. Hey, here's the resistance. Here's most of the resistance members injured. Ruth could have landed anywhere, but he committed all his forces here, East Africa, the ruins of New Mombasa. Ah, yes, after regret, slip bomb, slip space bombed it basically. We stopped it, but only temporarily. Yeah, chief. I think we would notice if it had fired. The Ark where he'll be able to fire all the Halo rings. If he succeeds, humanity, the Covenant, every sentient being in the galaxy. The rings will kill us all. Man, you have to I think, for the amount of times Truth has true. spoken to so-called oracles, also known as the monitors so in this see. universe, he, he might have cottoned so on green. that Halo so isn't a holy purpose, it just wipes shit out. Commander's come up with a good plan, but without you, I wasn't sure we could pull it off. Why? You've got like a dozen other Spartans on Earth. I'm not even kidding. Chief actually turns out not to be the last Spartan. I say a dozen, I think it's actually more like a couple of hundred. Because most of them become Spartan 4 trainers. I only have a handful of ships, Master Chief. It's a big risk. But I'm confident. not again. Emergency generators now. Shielding Who you plugged in the TV? As soon as they're up, re-establish contact with Lord Hood. Let him know. All of you vermin. Nice to see you too, Truth. Thinking what? I wonder that you might escape the coming fire. No, your world will burn until its surface is but glass, and not even your demon will live to creep. Blackened from its hold to mar the reflection of our passage, the culmination of our journey. For your destruction is the will of the gods. And I, I am their instrument. Charming guy. Cocky bastard just loves to run his mouth. Does he usually mention me? Give the order, we're closing shop. Ma'am? We're about to get hit. All personnel, the wounded. Code alpha We're getting all of them out. Immediate evacuation. I have to carry them myself. Ma'am, squad leaders are requesting a rally point. Where should they go? To war. And that's why you're in charge of fleet operations and not ground operations, because that isn't a physical rally point. Motion trackers? They're down. Don't get me wrong, it sounds cool, but I'm betting the squad leaders are all asking for no, clarification on where they're go, supposed to go. Now, where am I supposed to go? Phantoms closing on our position. Any birds left in five minutes out? Bring them in. Tell everything else to scatter. Aye, aye. Also, thinking about the Halo storyline, it's basically also, Star Wars away. in a different order. This is in essence the attack on Echo Base, isn't it, really? Anything about it? You know, underdogs fighting against a giant evil empire. Evil Empire discovers super weapon, is attempting to use super weapon, small group of resistance fighters destroy super weapon. Mainly one of the most talented members of that resistance group destroys the super weapon pretty much single-handedly then there's actually then there's actually a 
Another super weapon the evil empire has discovered, stroke found, that's even bigger than the last super weapon. Chief. And Good. This channel is secure. My fire teams are spread How do you know it's secure? And then once again, very small group of resistance fighters manages to destroy the weapon using someone who's unnaturally talented for the job. It's basically that. Why didn't you move the vehicle? I mean, if it attached to your wheel, great. Okay, I don't know what happened there. But that's a great start for this. Reverse the car! I love it when these idiots cluster up. I really do. Two for one there. If you're trying to look intimidating, you just look silly. Come here. And you're down. I know I'm supposed to go back there, but if I remember correctly, there's something around the corner here. Hey, open up! Password, please! You gotta be kidding me! What password? <laughs> the password so we don't open the door for brutes! Do I sound like a brute to you? Well, you could be held prisoner by brutes. If I was held prisoner by brutes and knew the password, then the brutes could just force me to tell you the password and you'd open the door for them. Okay, well now I'm definitely not gonna open the door. But we need ammo! Well, why don't you go ask your brute buddies then? <laughs> uh, I remember Halo 3 was one of those first games that actually invited YouTube. I know Rooster Teeth right now probably couldn't be counted as YouTubers, they'd be counted as video makers in their own right. But it was one of the first videos that invited them to actually participate in games and stuff like that as characters. I remember, I remember discovering that. I think it was after my first playthrough of Halo 3. Just so weird to me seeing people I loved watching in video games. It was awesome, but it not. Not like weird in a bad way. It was just unexpected. I didn't really believe my mates when they told me it happened. Or one of the reasons I got into machinima voice acting when I was back on one of my earlier channels. Pelicans can't launch until the hangar's clear. It's partly because I really enjoyed doing it. It's a lot of fun sometimes, especially when you get some really weird lines to say. But at the same time, let's take out this Phantom's turret. Because you'd think our air defences would be locking onto these bastards. See, don't invade when someone's got a machine gun to it. Never gone any well. Think I got him. Good man, whoever threw that grenade. Something I like doing, especially when you get riff lines, which is basically just... Look, this is just a not-so-serious line. We'll put it in at some point, just once in a while. Probably only get heard about once every... 16 times someone plays the game but still it's just hilarious some of the lines that make you do and it's what gets in and what doesn't it's a shame the machine machine sort of died out at the minute I mean it doesn't help when some of the people who do machine they really shouldn't you get some deep like I get that Machinima is also a fan fiction at times, and don't get me wrong, sometimes the storylines can be fun, but some sometimes you're, you're asked to do a Machinima series and it's just, what the fuck is this you've given me? Oh no, they do not take criticism well either. When you turn around and say to someone, no, I'm not, I'm not going to voice act for this series. Well, why not? Because of this. I'm glad to know everyone gets out apart from me. Oh, to be fair, that's more Marines that have survived than most during these Halo playthroughs. 
generally just ends up being chief as the last one alive. Of course, the massive bulky armor and shields tend to help that fact, but hey -o. I went a bit off topic there, didn't I? I was discussing how Halo was basically Star Wars, just with Empire Strikes Back here combined with Return of the Jedi. I wonder what John's... Are we sure we're not built on a fault line? Why does this base have vents as big in, vents and piping big enough for people to crawl through? That's just Attention. that's just Hustle, asking for trouble. We're with you, sir. Barracks are under attack. All available combat teams respond. Anyone in the barracks? I need a sit rep. I mean this base really has just gone to hell. Sir, this way. Watch out, you idiot! Light them up! Light them up! What the hell are those things, Sergeant? Round a whole swarm. Take them down. Short control first. Bring the major laugh. Is the fact that drone was introduced in Halo 2? If you're playing Halo 3, there's a good chance you played Halo 2. And yet they still have to explain what they are. So I forgot I've got deployable cover. Again, also, why build vent system that's big enough for these buggers to crawl into? Surely they've used this tactic before. I mean, I suppose it's a case of like if Halo, if you didn't. Halo 2 wasn't on PC until the remaster. So I suppose you might have missed out on him. I know I certainly did. I had to find a copy of... Okay, did you stand there? I had to find a copy of Halo 2 for Xbox 360 when I wanted to play it after I got Xbox... What, X, the original Xbox after I... discovered that it wasn't released on PC. Didn't play it until I had an Xbox One. So I didn't know what those drones were. Soon as the evacuation is complete, start the um, Understood. Good luck, everyone. See you on the last Pelican out. Why does it look like you're on the first Only Pelican out and leaving us with the bloody bomb? Oh great. Alright, what are we doing next? Come on, guys. I the like how the plan to evacuate the wounded's going well, side. Johnson. There's two of them Save down the here. We both know what they do to prisoners. Oh, I, I know. Get to the barracks. That's another messed up thing about this war. The Covenant tends to eat humans. Even, I, I think the elites consider themselves a bit above eating the enemy, but the rest of the species, not so much. Can't see a thing, and there's a chieftain with a grab hammer up there. Ah, the good old shotgun slam. Okay, it's a shame we got rid of the boot plasma rifle, actually. I hit him a bit hard then. Oh, it's learnt. I didn't learn because I didn't realise where he was. Oh, that was a hit. Chief's gonna feel that one if he ever wakes up. And so he's probably he won't. Yeah, very close, mate. I really don't like those flares, if I'm honest. I think I got him. He 
You know, if you'd hit me, you probably would have killed me there. Oh dear, they've learned. Not too well, however. Ow, damn it. That was the wrong place to put that. Okay, let's Really? A bit excessive on the grenades, aren't we? Oh, then again. Damn it! I also like how the assault rifle appears we've gone a bit more... Oh, hell. Ooh, that was closer than I wanted. That's the issue with those bloody grab hammers. They always seem to put them in areas where they'd be incredibly lethal. Right, that's that lot sorted. What's it doing? Saving Marines. Well, a bit too late for some of them. I could have sworn Johnson was supposed to be coming in there with me. I wonder where he is. Okay, apparently they're not attacking me. Well, I'm not going to waste the ammo. After, it tends to help persuading someone to fight for you if you're not shooting at them first. They're generally a bit more receptive. Messed up game of horseshoes. I miss the days where I could just one hit a brute with a shotgun. Oh, someone's thrown a bloody radar jammer down. Oh, definitely got a spike on my shoulder. Not gonna save you if I can hit him close, is it, idiot? Pfft. I think I got him. <laughs> right. Any more for any more? Looks like a few more. That looks like, yep, he's carrying a plasma cannon, isn't he? Yes, he is. Don't try and take on a bloody brute in hand-to-hand -hand combat, you're marines, not Spartans. And you are less scary than you used to be. Give him a good old shotgun slam. I like how that brute popped out of cover at near enough point-blank range and still missed. There's a lift outside. It's over. Honestly, how did... <laughs> Must be such a pain to try and get somewhere in this base.
crawling back to the hangar. But don't wait for us. What should I do, ma'am? Hold position. I'm not leaving without you. Yeah, I know that look. Yeah, we're probably gonna have to turn on the bomb. That's not the lift button, that's the lift button. One, two, three, four, three, four marines out of a barracks that looked like it held maybe 50. Good odds for Chief, really. Generally, when he commits to a mission, everyone dies. Oh boy, they've got jump packs. But they apparently have weaker shields. Ooh. It's them dealt with. Okay, there's more, isn't there? For the shield. What on earth? Guys, one grenade! That's all you need, just one grenade. I don't even need to do much, these movies seem pretty competent. He says, whilst getting punched in the face or messing up a reload. He's dead, Jim. Yes, and you're all still alive. That's genuinely surprising for me. Jones, go. I'll cover you. I could have sworn I just heard someone say drones. Where? Right, they're all ready to go, Brooks, and in the op center, they disarmed the bomb. I'm sorry, Commander. There were too many, even for me. Chief. It's not a statement. Johnson held up an entire and Covenant battalion once just by chucking grenades at them. But I'll radio with another exit. Good luck. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where's the Arbiter go? Oh, I see how it is. Leave me to deal with this shit. Fine. Uh, where's the op center? Where's the op center? This way? Base is like a maze. Refill the shotgun. Let's deal. Oh, this looks like the right way. I must admit, Halo has a lot of just walking around, doesn't it? Do I want cloaking or do I want to trip mine? Let's face it, me cloaked, it's going to be a very small amount of time before I just start firing at people. So, let's go with a trip mine. Mainly because it's hilarious watching brutes run straight into it. And this was the wrong way, wasn't it? Yep. Yes, it was. Oh, I'm such a fan of this game. Don't even know how to maneuver the map. Well, it looks like Johnson dealt with the drone issue very efficiently. By lights, do you mean the giant thermonuclear explosion that is probably waiting for these guys? You will be the protectors of Earth and Oh, Chief's tripping again. <laughs> Hello. Apparently, grunts have terrible peripheral vision. Also, thanks for giving me the new toy to deal with you all. Even though we are fighting around a giant gas tank, that could go terribly, look terribly wrong. Apparently that gun just exploded. Uh, 
pro tip, don't put people without shields on a turret. They tend to die a lot quicker than they can kill something. Okay. I see how this is. Let's play some peekaboo. Peekaboo, I kill you. Ooh. That's almost clever. Put your turret around the corner. Which way is it to Ops? That way? Kind of. No, no, this is the barracks route, isn't it? See what I mean? It's just really confusing. Oof. Half the part of time, it's probably just people wandering around because they got lost. Ah, here's the here's the place of the giant radioactive bomb. That's a fuel rod cannon. Let's deal with him first. We well, wasted his energy drain, and this was not the route I was planning. He actually took out his own brute shields. What a stupid commander. And again, brutes aren't exactly known for their brains. Do you mind? We are sort of fighting around a live nuclear device. Don't think it'll go too well. That did it, Chief. Bombs armed. We got your exit. A service elevator in the hangar. Head downstairs, cut through the caves. Um, what's the time on this bomb? Only because it feels a bit like it might be a, on a short fuse, let's call it that. Me. I'm going to deal with you lot. Cortana, now is not the time. I can need to leave before I get nuked. Yep, someone definitely didn't pay the electric bill. That was so stupid. So, so stupid. Here's this grenade. No, I don't want it returned. No, no, no. Boom, and I'm dead. Oh, Soft this. One way to clear the road. And I'm also really glad those gas tanks generally don't explode. Cortana, now is not the time. But the minute you're gonna make me dead if you keep stalling me. Honestly, it's your own fault, really. You clustered up when I've got a fuel rod gun. What do you expect is going to happen? Found it. No, my elevator. I'm going to live, you're going to die. Generally how this works. Bye. Half a Ooh, that was closer than I expected. This place will become your home. Must go faster. Must go faster. This place will become your tomb.
So that was Halo 3 Crow's Nest. Thank you everyone so much for joining me and following me as I play through the Halo series again. This has been Procrastinating Sign. This has been pro this has been Procrastinating Gaming saying thank you so much for watching. Hit that subscription button to stay in touch with the channel and ring that bell to so be notified whenever I upload. I'll see you next time for Tosavo Highway.